And the bang bang! Welcome to that madness. I've just been standing here and making tape loops with this uh, cassette player kalimba. The tape loop kalimba. Kaleidal loop. That's another thing actually. Uh, I don't remember the name of this one. But huge shout out to uh, Battery Operated, who made it! There's gonna be links for their video. The making of video and demo and stuff. And also Instagram. Just go to the description and you will find links. Because I didn't make this. But I promise to collect uh, tape loops with it. As well as with my cassette player Kalimba. Which sort of started it all when I did another video. When I did the Kalimba ukulele. No, no, no. The cassette player ukulele. But the Kalimba ukulele is not a bad idea. Actually, I called dibs on the idea of making a cassette player kalimba and this, this is how I've envisioned it with the kalimba being on the cassette player but these guys did this before I did that but they had it as their own original idea because they also have an idea book and speaking of idea book ideas 2021 kalimba Ukulele. Where was I even? Uh, yes, I have been uh, collecting tape loops into DAW, which is sort of losing the purpose of the tape loop, I guess. But that doesn't matter because I make a tape loop and then I record it and they are all for you. For channel members was the idea initially, like a dope. A sample pack. The most lo-fi kalimba ever imagined by a human. Probably not by aliens. They imagine everything in very lo-fi. High tech, but lo-fi. Anyways, I'm thinking now that we do Discord, Magpie Pirates album, based on all of these. So it's gonna be open for everyone, not only channel members, but please become a channel member anyways. I'm gonna drop it on the Discord before I drop this video. So it's already up there. Anyone can download and we make a cassette player kalimba album where you can do whatever you want. But that's the samples that I drop. So I think I'm gonna work on this. Maybe that can be like a very avant-garde intro. Going back to these stuff, mine is way bigger. And this function is also very cool. That's the OSP. Otherwise, this one works with the internal mic of the cassette player. This one has a PSO. So it's a contact mic going to the cassette player, uh, if I remember correctly. They talk about it in their video. They both have a pitch knob, boom boom. But this one can already do half tempo within it. So you can go 24. Uh, 48. They also took out the erase head on this one, so you can do layers, which is really cool. I never bothered doing that because it just means I gotta go to something else <laughs> to erase. Sounds very disgusting, but in kind of a good way. It's like very, very, very lo-fi. I like it, actually. Okay, there was something on that tape. Shout out to Take for supplying with the tape loops. It's gonna be a link. Now though, I think that maybe try to make something out of this craziness, but then also moving over to recording to a bunch of different already ongoing projects. I just found a working tempo for that little one. I don't think the drums are gonna be like this though. But it's kinda nice. Sometimes bad is good. Mm. 
Maybe not the last one. Maybe. What's so fascinating is how uh, compressed the tape sound feels, at least. Right? Because, I mean, usually with piezo, you, it, it, you get a lot of shittiness in it. But the tape compresses that, makes it really, really dull, in a way, that is very nice. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Ah. Something like that. Maybe more sounds that are like growing into it. Less is more though. I feel like uh, that's taking away from this one and this video is supposed to be about this one. So let's uh, have me working on that intro project for that album off camera and now we open something else and we add this one to what I already have started. Uh, so we focus on this instead of focusing on having started with it and then because it's very easy to whoa, 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 whoa. So while that one is starting, we erase the tape. So for something like this, we create a track with uh, the very few sounds. It's like a transition type part. Perfect for something like this. be perfect. Tune in. This Imagine with vocals. I mean, you can argue that no, oh, you don't hear much of it, but it adds that sparkle. Let's open another one. That was fast. This is such a banger. I made it with this one. The balloon organ. The video. Blow me up and let me go like I'm a balloon. I need to do octave up. Can't really do it. Oh, I'm not gonna be able. Shit. Blow me up and let me go like I'm on the loom. Cause I promise I will circle back and land next to you. Sorry. That's a journey for his mother time. <laughs> but if I, yeah, drag that stuff. So we have only this. Can I use it as a drum? It's not an amazing drum. So nice. 
And it does so good with the... The Casio drum. And that movement. Maybe meow keyboard. Actually, no. Uh, I want this to be a, like a short video that consists of uh, whatever I just did in the video. Mainly giving Battery Operator a huge shout out for doing this. Uh, lovely, lovely project. I hope to see much more of your DIYs. And uh, I hope many of my ideas inspire they already had this idea but maybe some of my original ideas can inspire you to do stuff and then i want to see it so show me tag me on instagram show me on discord uh, link in the description link to those guys uh, obviously join the discord also to join this album project so let's make a super lo-fi album together and i will smell you later in an elevator so thank you for watching <laughs> bye